This video will show you how to submit assignments in your Blackboard courses at Charter Oak State College. To submit assignments, you will generally follow a few basic steps. Be sure to follow any specific directions your instructor may give you. Otherwise, you will submit assignments in your courses pretty much the same way using the, assi the assignment submission tool in Blackboard. Once you've done it a few times, there's nothing to it. To begin with, the assignment submission tool, or sometimes called the submit assignments link, is located in about the same place in almost all Charter Oak courses. Go into the course content section of your course. This is where you will find all the information you will need for any week of your course. You're going to go into the relevant week that you'll be submitting work for by clicking on the link or icon for that week. So in this case, we're going to go into week three. And within the weekly content folder, you're going to find the folder labeled Submit Assignments. This will usually be one of the third or fourth items within a weekly page. And you may need to scroll down the page to find it. And in this case, here it is down at the bottom. I found the Submit Assignments folder. I'm going to click on that link to get into the Submit Assignments folder. And then you find the link through which you're going to submit your assignment. Sometimes you will have more than one assignment due in a week. And if that's the case, there will usually be separate links on this page for each assignment that's due in that week. Make sure you follow the instructions about how your instructor wants you to submit your work and click on the link to access the assignment submission page in your Blackboard course. In this case, the assignment is called Assignment 1, so I click on the link to access the assignment submission page for Assignment 1. Your instructor will often ask you to submit your assignment as a Word document or possibly another type of file. Submitting your assignment as a separate file to Blackboard is much like attaching a file to an email message. Click the Browse My Computer link and find the file on your computer that you will submit as your assignment. So here I've clicked the Browse My Computer button and I'm going to find the file that I want to submit as an assignment on my hard drive. And here it is, it's called Sample Assignment. So I click on that and I click Open. And now that I've found and selected the file that I want to submit to my instructor, I see it here on the submission page. I see that it's attached. If you would like to write some text in Blackboard that your instructor will see with your submission along with the file you submitted, or if your instructor has asked you to just type your work into the assignment submission tool in Blackboard without submitting or attaching a file at all, you just click on the Write Submission button. This will open the text submission box in Blackboard. The text submission tool includes a number of font and format, formatting options that you can use, much like Microsoft Word or many other types of word processing software. So I'm going to type some text in here. And now that I've got my text typed in and I have my file attached, I can click Submit. Now remember, you don't necessarily have to type anything in the text submission box and you don't necessarily have to attach a file. It all depends on how your instructor has asked you to submit your work for any particular assignment. Once you've included all the information you're going to include for your submission, you click on the Submit button. Note that there's a submit button at the top of the page and also a submit button down at the bottom of the page. It doesn't matter which one you click, they both do the exact same thing. Once you've clicked submit, your, work will, your works will be available for your instructor for grading and you will see the review submission history page and you can go back and forth between the text that you typed in or the file that you attached. Once you've reviewed your assignment, you can then click OK and continue working in Blackboard. You can also check your Grade Center to see the status of your submission and to view your grade once your instructor has graded it. You just click on Grade Center and you see here for Assignment 1 it's submitted and this little exclamation mark means that it needs grading. It means your instructor has not graded it yet. Once your instructor has graded your assignment, you will see your grade appear here in your Grade Center. 
If you have any questions about your assignment and submission, you should contact your instructor or you can contact the help desk by clicking on the tech support link at the top of the page and you find information about contacting tech support here on this page. Thanks for watching this video on submitting assignments in Blackboard and good luck!